welcome back to the long dark and back to connector region survival or crs or as we gave uh homage to seraphim the seraphim our sire spin directive so it is almost morning and we are picking up where we left off um, in the trailer in Keepers Pass South. So we didn't get a ton done. Um, episode 2, we got over here. We kind of established a little bit. But um, we're going to have to push outwards a little bit. We're going to have to start dealing with the wolves and uh, learn how to coexist with, uh, with them. So... We need to start gathering up as much um, sticks and firewood as we can. We don't have hardly any food left. And so we need to work on all that stuff. So Episode 2 was probably the easy part with getting over here. We knew we had some supplies. So now the survival part kicks into play now we have to, find to food. yeah that's exactly it will we need to find food we've got a little bit here it looks like yeah we could make some pancakes eventually i'm not sure we've got extra clothes cargo pants cargo pants what are we wearing i forget now okay we're decently outfitted we could use another jacket but we're decently outfitted. We'll just have to keep an eye on this stuff and make decisions on what we do and don't repair. Got a little bit of scrap, good. Okay. Now, what do we got on us? got a reishi we got some uh, we need some old man's beard to get that out of our life how are we doing on weight We're doing good on weight I wanted to try to keep light and two arrow shafts so we could make an arrow We have a arrow, and we can make an arrow. We probably ought to make an arrow if we have enough. If we have enough feathers for that. Got one arrowhead. I'm not sure we have enough. No, nope, we need another feather. Okay, so. Can make some potatoes, it looks like. But it's not Maglin's weather. And I do believe. Unless I set some somewhere. Let's take a look. Okay, we do have some backup matches. Crowbar. Okay. Okay. Empty, empty. All right. Twelve rounds of that, and one round of that. We did find one maple sapling, so we can build another bow. That's beautiful. Doubt we're gonna find a gun over here. I'll be shocked if we find that. And then if we do, it'll probably be in in the north. So. I'm going to go ahead and get this out with my one, my one arrow. And I don't necessarily want to kill the wolves because they will eventually come back. 
So it, it'll give me a break for a little while, but I'd rather find some ways to work around them. Eventually, I would like to figure out a way to to get a few of them harvested. I think we could use a wolf coat at some point. I'd also like to um, maybe venture over to Keeper's Pass North before we start losing so much condition because this is kind of a, a learning process too with this one. We were already late. And um, so I'm kind of using this as a as a training session, so to speak, we scope out. Now, granted, RNG can change and what have you, but we could see what resources over there. Um, I did walk through here on my Dead World run, and so I could eat anything right now. I know, well, you know, we may not get to keep well fed. Um. When I walk through here on a Dead World run, it's set on way high difficulties for food, so um, it's even got less loot than Interloper, so not knowing exactly what we were going to find or not find. Um, but I did notice that there were like rabbits, which shouldn't have shown up on Dead World, <laughs> which I thought was funny, but... Um, there were rabbits over there. So we do know we've got rabbits to harvest. Any more? Yep, there's some more. We might have to try some of the tip-ups. There is the fishing hut. But if we could build a tip-up and get away with it over here somewhere, this might be easier to excess than going down to the fishing hut where there are so many wolves. All right, we got to be careful. The loading screen is going to come. I think we'll just make the car as the end of the road there because that loading screen will come up. We need to gather sticks. And I need to be very conscious about fire. We need to walk the dogs as much as possible. Try to avoid the wolf struggles, but try to avoid also just doing the normal routine of just lighting a torch right away. Just need to work around that. So it would be nice to build one more arrow. I had had high hopes in having more than just two. But two is better than none, so I'll go with that. I don't know, did we check this? We did. Why didn't we put the hood up? Silly man. We aren't super cold, but we are hungry. I'm going to go ahead and eat a single cat now. I'm going to try and keep the well fed going, but I have a feeling we're going to we're gonna run into that as an issue as time progresses. Anything good up here? I think this is going to be a series of uh, small victories where we learn how to do things a little better as we try. We definitely could have done things better in PV. I mean, one, we were late. My head feel thick. And yeah, your head's thick, all right. And the other thing that I think we could have done better is we definitely could have. Um, gotten more stuff. Uh, what am I looking for? Oh, hello. 
I'm just going to go inside. I don't want to confront him. I'm standing right there. Okay, that's all I cloth. I was just going to drop the wood. He's going to be my biggest nemesis. I think the other three are down in the river. So I think he's going to be the, the bigger nemesis. So let's just warm up. I need another cattail. I'm not going to break into the pancakes just yet. But I don't want to eat all my cattails either. I want to kind of use those as travel food. So, there. I'll tell you what. Let's go. Let's try to play this safe a little bit. Pass a little bit of time. I eat anything right about now. Yeah, no. And I think this is going to be our big thing. We're going to keep stockpiling sticks and things. Do we have any? Hmm. Let's go see if we can make a tip up here. Do we have, do we have the necessary things? What do we need? Fishing tip up. Well, we have scrap metal right here. And we have a hacksaw. We can hack the heck out of a lot of things. A couple of sticks, claw. All right, let's give this a shot here. Like I said, I'd love to be able to set up shop where I don't have to fight with him every moment of the day. So we have a bucket. We can cut that up for scrap, okay. All right, we got well fed. Now we need to try to keep well fed. What condition are these in? At near death levels. All right. So I want to be able to come back here and bust all this stuff up. Where are you at, you jerk? You're way down there. All right, I'm gonna walk away from you. You just stay down there. Ignore the man with the bow. We've got some open water here anyway, so. Suitable ice. Alright. So are we not in suitable ice anywhere over here? Let me go closer to where this you know, let's go back this way. Maybe the water's a little deeper over here. Okay, it started to crack right there. Oops. So maybe I can't put one over here. Okay, fine. You'd think I'd be able to set something up next to this opening, but I guess not. The game will let us do what the game will let us do. Well, maybe we can set up shop next to the fishing hut and we'll double up on it. I've seen a few people do that. Alright, where's our buddy at? to be stealthy here. Right, he's 
in animation right now, so that's good. Hopefully I don't stink to high heaven. There's something I'm not aware of. We don't have hardly anything. I think my stomach is eating itself. Yeah, so much for well fed. All right. He's over there. I think we're going to have to have a confrontation. Let's be patient. See where he's going. Probably wants to go right where I wanted to go. I wanted to go explore maybe being able to go down towards that fishing thing. Okay. Well, if you're going to go over here... Alright, I like where you're going. No, I don't like where you're going. I like that I can at least be crouched and kind of avoid him. This might be our, uh, our existence for a while. But that's what we're going to have to deal with. Okay, I do have the bedroll with me. They're very noisy. Yep, I hear you. I hear you, but I got on the rock better than I thought it would. Can we go? There we go. All right. I like this. We can just get past him. If anything, I just get him behind me. But that's the group down there I'm not looking forward to. There's three of them down there. He ain't got enough arrows for them. But I do believe the fishing hut is down that way. Maybe we could use him to our advantage. We could walk him down. Keeper's Pass North is that way. Where are you at? I can't see you with all the trees anymore. There you are. Alright. Ah. Alright. Good job. He's after a rabbit. Good. Alright, so there's our fishing hook. I don't know if we can go down that or not, but we're going to try. All right, let's check over here. is a climb up, okay. There's a ravaged deer down there. Well, at least I know I can get one deer hide. Can't feel my feet. Yeah, we're gonna be fighting the cold and the hunger. Blizzards could actually be my friend if I can get a spot to get down to the fishing hut with enough wood, even if I have to walk the long way around. This is looking very promising. Come on. Need to make some fire hardened arrows too and get some more crows feathers. I don't know if the ptarmigans hang around here, but 
Yeah, I think we could definitely get down there from there, so. Even if we had to spend a blizzard time in there to avoid. Alright, tell you what. Eat a cattail so we're not fighting food and cold. Right, let's keep going. We ain't gonna learn nothing unless we explore. I can't let the wolves keep me pinned in at the trailer. I'm gonna have to worry about how to deal with them. Like that one right there. We managed to get around him. So. Die if I don't warm up soon. Yeah. I think we're getting a blizzard, which might actually play to our favor, huh? Yeah? Let's go over here and get some more wood. Let's pretend like we're gonna go over here and get some more wood. myself in. Come on. Come on, Will, lift your feet. Say we got a rose hip. And shoot the car. This stuff will come in handy. Oh, unbelievable. How did we find a Mackinac in there? Get inside. How did we find that? I was so disappointed we didn't find one under the bed. It needs repaired. Are we warm in here? But no, we are not warm in here. Damn it! If we get that thing fixed up, that may change our stars just a little bit. Did we put that thing. All right. We need to do some repairs on both of those things. All right. Let's take advantage of this. I know we're cold and we're losing health, but our wolf buddies are not out right now, so now's the time to be doing this. What have we oh, here? looky, looky you. That's a great find. That's a great find. Okay. Getting so the keeper, keeper's pass here. Battery. like fighting the cold and the hunger all at the same time. Let's see what we can find over here. Alright, this is all. Can we do a tip up here by chance? No. Oh, aren't you a good sight. Another bow available to us.
I believe we've got some sustainability going now. My biggest problem was the lack of arrowheads. I'm gonna take advantage. Come on, grab the stick, put the ball in the boat. take advantage of this storm, sacrifice a little bit of health, and I know I'm going to heal this is Stalker, so I've got a little bit of advantage there. I'll take advantage of going over the Keeper's Path more. I can't believe we found a Mackinac. That was a great find. I know where I'm hungry. Let's hope we find some goodies here tonight. At least we can make some tea. Really crazy. Damn it. So hungry. I need to utilize this one too. Let's go warm up. And then we can take a look. I think we are out of territory at this point, so. wonder if I can drop any of this gear. Mm, not at the moment. Alright, are we warm in here? Yes. Okay. Ooh. There's two limbs in here. It takes an hour and a half, but we are cold. Or aren't cold. So. Cedar limb, fir limb, that's gray. Right? This is a fir? Yeah. Let's keep going. I'd love to find another arrow or two. That would be like the ultimate. I wish I would have found the pistol too, that would have been nice. We could have done an early run with the pistol and the wolves and just shot each of them once. Used four rounds of ammo, because you can still crouch with that being down. So we could have we could have shot all four of them. And then collected all that meat and all those hides and stuff. And then had free reign in that area. So that would have been an awesome little set up there. out of this stuff. Alright. Good job. I'll turn it on as I need it. Let's go ahead and drink the soda. A little thirsty, it'll give us some calories. This will stop the clock on losing health. nice thing is is that we really could we could, we could technically kind of just sleep here and stay warm with the fact that we have the bed roll and all that stuff. 
Does it appear of any interest? No. Up over here. No. Actually, I'm kind of glad the blizzard hit when it did. Okay, we didn't search everything, everything, but... Let's poke our head out over here. Okay, we're still dealing with the blizzard. We're not quite warmed up, so let's go back and explore. I think that's going to be interesting is there's two sides to the coin. You could stay in Keeper's Pass North and not have to deal with the wolves at all, but it's going to be difficult staying warm because there's no place to really live. I mean, there may be a cave I'm not aware of, but the only place that has like the stove or anything is that little house that is broken down. So you, I don't think we'd be able to stay warm in there during storms without burning wood. So. so this might be a little bit of a break. Really, you're tired already? You haven't done anything. And I'm kind of just doing right hand rule, just kind of wandering and checking. What might be a good use of my time, depending on how much cloth I have, is trying to fix that Mackinac. this? I may have missed this. Okay. Oh. <laughs> Aren't you a sight for Sora? I could use this. This is where we came in at. Boy, did I miss a bunch. I'm so glad we walked back through. I was still looking at the wood and everything. Alright. I think because we found a match and because of all this, I think we're making a fire here. It also give us an excuse to pull some torches. Let's use the crappy matches to light a torch. Save that. Tell you what, use a stick. And use the torch for God's sake. We just lit it. This will be a good find here because we can just harvest all this stuff and leave it in here. We don't have to drag it back with us. We can let it cure in here, come back for it, and not have to drag it in front of the wolves, raw and fresh. All right, so add some fuel here. I do not want to use my coal. Sticks are gonna be somewhat replenishable. But let's put a cedar in here. Okay, and then, I hope I brought something to make water in. I was hoping that I left at least one can to make water. Alright, let's see what kind of meal we get in this. Oh, that's not too shabby. 25 minutes, that's about right. Use the knife and do it a little faster. Let's use the hacksaw. We've got some time. So this will give us some fuel. Where can I find something to eat? Right here. Well, we're making it. Give me a second. Yeah, I don't think I'm going to worry about well-fed. I don't think it's... It's going to be nice to have if we can get a sustainable amount of food, which I think is going to be predicated on, unfortunately, wolves. 
It may take a long time to get to cooking level 5 to make it worthwhile, but you could take the risk with the parasites a little bit. We gotta be careful about that too. We don't have so much ratio. it up let's get in the habit of just taking it all right so we got 30 40 minutes let's see what we can get off of here the hide is an hour the guts are an hour hour 20 by hand 40 minutes 20 minutes all right let's do this We'll drop those too. I mean, we're living in this little space. I mean, this could just be our micro micro living situation. We may have the trailer in the south, we may have the house in the north, and we have the cave in the middle, and we'll just have to kind of travel between them for stuff. So this will be our little focal point here. We may even, if we find a second bedroll for some bizarre, silly reason, we'll just leave it here, and that way we've always got a place to hang out. We're warm. All right, eat that. That'll make you feel a little better for a while. And some more water. We could even leave water behind if we need to. Let's see if we can get a gut real fast. Oh, we already got the gut. 30 minutes, so we need some time. I don't want to burn them. I don't want to burn the food, man. Alright, eat that. And... I think we can I think we can do that. I think we can do that. I'm gonna use the knife. I don't think we can get away with that, but let's go ahead and use the knife. I think we have a stone. I'm just glad we have a freaking bedroll, that helps so much. Make some more water. That should do us there. Just drop that. All right. I always like finding these inside the cave, like when I'm doing the Dead World runs. It's nice because it's you don't you're not gonna freeze to death. You're not gonna die from hypothermia or any of that other stuff. So, all right, we've got one cloth on us. I don't think that's enough to do the Mackinac. Hang on, where am I at? Here? Mac actions. Yeah, we need to. God, we got to get that repaired. We got enough stuff back at the trailer to make that happen. All right. You know what? We need torches. We don't have much for torches. And we're gonna take any can't be picky. I'll just have to make sure that I use the crappier ones first. That's perfect.
finding that other box of matches is nice. It means we can hold out. We definitely want... See, there might be a point of where, okay, we have a sunny day. We can start a fire in the barrel. We can light some torches. And that will allow us to work our way through the wolves. If we're, we're underweight, we don't have any issues. We can just walk through the wolves, get over to the fishing area, and then just fish. Pick that up. How are we doing on water, by the way? Fantastic. Gotta always travel with at least one can. And just let that burn out. We'll let this stuff sit here. Now, technically, we get on the other side here. There shouldn't be any predators. But there's no reason why we can't just leave that stuff behind. How heavy are we? Heavier than we need to be. What can we drop here? You know what? You know what? I'm going to take that with me because I have no idea what we've got ahead of us. I could leave the hammer behind. Pick it up on the way back. That'll help save some weight. Let's refuel the lantern. And bind the weight. Oh, we do have oats on us. Why do we have that on us? Right. Oh, we could. You know what? I wonder if it would be worth it to harvest these items and then fix the Mackinac. It would also be worth fixing these underwear. You know what? Let's hold off. Let's hold off. We may find some cloth that we don't need to do that. So, all right. Or make a rash decision. So. I'm heavier than I should be, but let's. We're gonna live with it. We'll live with it for now. Get our way to the exit. I may actually go ahead and just sleep. We've got a full belly, and we can regain our health. It's nice that you can go through this without the need for light. wasn't sure how this was going to play out because I knew it was going to have its difficulties because of the wolves and that but I think the blizzard actually gave us um, a little bit of a window to be able to do that and I think it's just going to get to a point where we're going to have to kind of pick and choose our battles I need to find some more crow feathers build at least the one more arrow that would be nice I think that's my biggest uh, regret is that we didn't find at least one or two more arrows okay and look we've got another meal right there we're not that cold this might be a boon here. Mm. 
You know what? We're going to leave it alone. We aren't going to touch it. We'll grab it on the way back. It's just a meal waiting for us on the way back. Nice thing is, it's like ravine, there's no wolves. Well, crows just showed back up, that's a good sign. And we're warming up, that's a beautiful sign. If we could get that Mackinac up the snow, that will help immensely. Alright, well... I'm going to need to rest soon. Yeah, you're going to need to rest soon. Let's grab a little more ammunition here. I think 11 is enough. The one thing that's over here that um, helps us is there's rabbits. So we may grab some rabbits and use that for food and supplies. And then we can uh, find a place to hunker down. I need tinder still. I don't know why I'm throwing that down. There they are. Little bunny rabbits. Cattails, this is, I hope, be the bunny. <coughs> oh, you threw it badly. At least you don't have far to run, bud. All right, all right, calm down, calm down. It's getting dark out here. Time to look for shelter. How about time to get food? One buns calm down here. Where'd you go, buddy? Where'd you run off to? There's an aurora. Okay, I see you now. Alright. The one with the rock here. Oh, I am so bad at this. Aurora doesn't bother me now. We're out of the wolves area. Come on, Bun Bun, calm down. <laughs> I knew that was a long shot even just before I did it. Alright, let's get up here. Maybe this will calm him down. I want you. You need to come with me. Need to follow me. Oh, here we go. Come on. Be 
very, very quiet when hunting rabbits. Where are you, Bun Bun? Where did you go? Oh, there you are. <laughs> Finally! Twelve rocks later. All right. Sorry about that. Thank you. Fly over there. Pick up sticks. There's another spot up here where there's a couple more, but I'm not going to worry about grabbing every one of them. I mean, we do need to find a place to get some rest here. Right, low bridge. The thing that's going to be interesting about this challenge is multiple tries and then in each multiple try or each attempt that you make you know rng is obviously going to be an issue i mean to be honest but you know like okay let's say this run i last x days can i push that envelope to last two days more or can i last a week longer what things could I do differently that would give me a chance to live longer? That's going to be the interesting part. You know, what's going to be, you know, harvestable? I mean, if we had gotten a couple more arrows, dealing with the wolves would have been, you know, academic. I just would have killed them one at a time and dealt with them. Same thing like I was talking about with the pistol. If I would have gotten the pistol with 12 rams of ammo, I know that at least, you know, three times... I can wipe out the entire population of wolves, have free reign of Keeper's Path South, fish like crazy, stockpile all the wolf meat, stockpile all the fish. Now there's more rabbits. I see one cutting across. I think we should be fairly close to that little broken down house, which is where I'm headed. I'm headed to that little broken down house. I figured that's where we're going to stay the night. We're going to hang out there. And I think we're going to stay over here for a little while, as long as we can feed ourselves. Which, I mean, we've got two more rabbits right there. So, you know, after two hours of hunting, I should be able to get two rabbits. Yeah. All I need is, you know, a dozen rocks. Let's do that down again. I'm not going to try to do it now. We're too heavy. One. Two, we're tired. I'm not going to be able to sprint. Got no nothing to sprint with. And it'll be my luck that I'll hit the rabbit and then not get to him fast enough in order to do anything about it. Just waste the time. So. Oh, I see right shoes. That's awesome. I'm getting weaker. Yeah, you're getting weaker, all right. I think when we do this again, too, we'll do. Uh, 
we'll, we'll swap back and forth between Astrid and Will. I tend to play Will because it, it's more of a... Everybody plays Astrid, and, and I know he wheezes a lot, and he's, he's noisy, but... Gotta give Will his props. But if we do this again, we'll try Astrid. There's our little domicile. Yeah, we're so heavy. This week on Fixer Upper. We're gonna take this shanty and turn it into a palace. All we need is about a million dollars. Most of it in transportation costs to fly in the needed items to build this. I, if this is the thing that I always think about is like, okay, um, all this stuff is cut lumber, even with perseverance mills that they talk horse. about. Somebody had to haul this stuff here. I find that amazing. All right, I don't think we want to burn this stuff. I think we want to keep it. Oh, aren't you a great sight? Because you know what we have? Besides peanut butter, which is great, but we have this oat pack butter. is getting too heavy to carry. Hang on, hang on. Hang on. That's not bad. Here, we're gonna dump all this sticks we've been carrying. Uh, da -da 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 -da. Looking in the wrong place. Drop all. We'll just pick up some. Three, four, five. That'll work. Okay. I'm not gonna worry about a fire. The gloves will be for leather. Wait, what? Let's take... Oh, spray paint. Awesome. Let's dump you out. The other cool thing is, is that there's a bed over here, so in essence... What I could do to help lighten the load is I could leave the bedroll. Well, that may not be a good idea. I was thinking I could leave the bedroll in the cave, but there may be a point where we're fishing where we might have to pull that little trick where you do the thing. So it's an idea though. I'm trying to think outside the box, but the thought is that the bedroll weighs, eh, it's a kilo. It would have lightened the load a little bit. So anyway, let's... Let's eat a couple of cattails. I'll save the peanut butter for the morning. If it's a Maglin's day, we will make a fire and cook. Get our rabbit. If I have to, we'll eat the peanut butter. The water. I'm not too worried about using up the the rose hip teas. If I use them, I use them. The ones I want to be very careful with are the reishi, because that's the antibiotic, and the coffee I want to keep as emergencies. Like we need to, you know, hump it home to a specific spot. But uh, oh, we do have planks here that we can. Okay, cool. All right, let's go to sleep. I wonder if it's going to get a ton colder. I'm afraid to go at this. Alright, let's sleep a couple hours at a time here. Won't get the heal that I want, but... I don't want to freeze to death either. We're only getting a plus three. Alright. We healed up better than I thought. See, now it's negative four. 
I'm wondering if it would be time well spent. Wait a second here. Let's go into here. I could eat Where's anything. That? Tell you what, let's harvest these. Okay, now, by the graces, the Aurora will stay in and we'll get this on the first try without failing. Okay, we got it up to 58. And we're still too cold. All right, this is what I was worried about over here. How about our sleeping bag? Will the sleeping bag be of any better? I think you could double that up. Ooh, that was negative 14. That's even money. All right, we've got a little bit of playroom. I'm gonna sleep for an hour. If we're cold, then I'll... Yeah, we're getting a storm. I may have no choice. We're double down. Minus eight, minus nine. All right, we're gonna have to. Yeah. Can't feel my hands. At least we have some fire. Just like this. We got a stove. We we'll make some water. Torch, so. All right, we'll go outside and we'll grab the rabbit real quick. We'll go ahead and harvest him. Come on. Thank you, Will. That was amazing. So cold. Well, if you get the fire lit, we wouldn't have this being cold. Problem. Now I'm glad I grabbed all those sticks. Come on. And we do have some plants we can cut down. I've never been so hungry in my life. Yeah, one problem well, at a time. Thank goodness for that. Right, let's see if we can warm this up. I'm gonna save my coal. That's like super duper emergency. Sleep an hour. We need some food here. Just eat one cat thing. I saw a couple more floating up there. Let's sleep an hour. We have a three hour fire. It can't go out because it's in a secure space. Okay, we've warmed up quite a bit. Let's go get our rabbit outside here. Hurry up, Bundler. We don't have much to go on up here. Alright, let's use the knife to harvest them. And then we'll skin him and gut him with our hands and save the utensil. Down. Drop that. 31 minutes, 40 minutes. How much of this can we do here? We our hands. 40 minutes there. 40 minutes there. Even money. I think we'll be alright. Think about it. 
Not a great amount of food. Make more water. We're not going to carry five liters of water. We're just going to take. It. We're going to make as much as we can to leave behind. But I'm going to sleep for two hours. We need all the rest we can get now. Okay, storm is over. That's good. How much time we got on here? Let's make another liter of water. We're going to leave that cooking right pot now. here. I think that's going to be a good idea. And then let's take and... We'll have some ice water for the summer. It's funny that I can stack it in there. Alright, that's probably pretty good. Yeah, that'll give us a little either. That'll be good. and see what we can find right here close by. There's more Raishi. I need to drop something. Yeah. Well, guess what? more sticks on the can. Nice to know that we can cut up some limbs. That's what I mean. Maybe that's what we'll do. Um, we'll have to, have to save it for the next episode. We're going to pretty much put a conclusion on this. Just wanted to kind of Scope out the area. Oh, look, another maple. That's actually... I'm quite happy to see that. Alright, wasn't quite expecting to find that, but that's... Also, very cool. More matches. That is amazing. Feathers. We can start doing some fire-hardened arrows. I like the fact that we're finding this maple because maybe I could be a little bit um, silly and actually hunt the rabbits with the bow a little bit just to get the bow skill up. I don't expect to get much further than maybe two, but I would assume two is better than one, and that might help with the wolves. So I'll take any advantages we can get. All right. Rabbits are just around the corner. Oh, birch too. Grab this. There's more supplies here than I was anticipating. I wasn't expecting to have but maybe one maple. 
And I know they won't cure here, but this is stuff to take with us back to the cave. Replenish our supply here. Just drop them all and grab three. Eat anything right about now. Okay, we've got an hour left on the fire. Non potable water. 16 minutes till boil, so let's take that. Let's do another liter of water. Let's get this up to an hour. Actually, let's do a little more than an hour. And I'll eat a cattail. And I'm going to sleep for an hour. This is plus three. Hang on, let's see. And this is plus five, so. So if we're not if we're in a hurt, we can sleep over here, but we're not gonna be as warm as the sleeping bag. So sleeping bag carrying it with me is probably the best, so. I hear the wind blowing again. And I guess it will be fine. What I'd really like to find is some more cloth, but at any rate. That's going to be it. I think we did okay today. We found a Mackinac. We found some deer carcasses. And we found a little bit of food. We have found another hacksaw, a hatchet, and some more saplings. So if I can keep the food thing going and not get eaten by the wolves right away. And the hatchet, I think, is really what's going to help in that. Because that was my biggest worry was the struggles. The struggles will be a little bit easier with uh, Stalker. My biggest issue is going to be the clothing. But um, there's still some spots that we can um, search over here. There's a couple areas we haven't touched yet. So we're going to do that on the next episode. We're going to go ahead and explore the rest of Keepers Pass North. Um, try and push this to as far as we can. There, I'm hoping that between fishing and, and the rabbits, we last longer than a week, but I think we're doing pretty good. Anyway, thank you very much for watching, and we will see you in episode four as we do more exploring and more surviving in CRS, Connector Region Survival. So thank you again for watching, and we'll catch you on the next one.